More than ever, customers are relying on online reviews to help them figure out where to eat. And for a lot of guests, eating out at a restaurant is a special occasion, right? Because they may have families, and so going out is, is expensive nowadays for families. And so they want to make sure that wherever they go, it, it's going to be something that is going to be um, something special, right? That doesn't happen every, every day or very often. So for this reason, people want to collect as much information as possible ahead of time so they can be sure that they will have a memorable and delicious experience when they come to your location, for example, especially if they have families. Uh, so it is important now more than ever to increase positive online reviews, especially that in today's day and age, it's so easy to do that. And in order for you to maintain a great reputation on your restaurant and be able to continue to attract new customers, it's good to focus on a fair amount of time on uh, of your branding and marketing into increasing positive online reviews. Hi, my name is Leo, and today I'm going to be sharing with you information about how to increase positive online reviews in for your restaurants in four simple steps. Uh, before I get started, I would like to introduce you to check out my website, www.digitaltrack.co, and in it, you will find a link there to check out a free training video I made uh, of the same exact system I use for my clients to help them get new customers every month on demand and to help them to build loyal customers that want to continue to come back. So again, visit www.digitaltrack.co. Uh, for that special, for that free video about uh, uh, training video of the same exact system I use uh, and put in place for my clients to help them get customers on demand every month for the restaurant. All right, so let's go start it. Let's get started. Number one, invite your regular customers to provide reviews. So if you have a, a solid bait of regular customers who love your business and with whom you already develop and establish a relationship, you can reach out to them and invite them to leave positive reviews online, right? It, now, it's best to do this in person. And at the end, for example, at the end of a great experience that your customer had, that's probably the, one of the best time for you to ask them if they can leave on online reviews. All right, so number two, build relationships with your clientele. So what if you are... A new business that doesn't have an established relationship with regulars well then is a, a great time for you to start building that loyal to, loyal customer base so take notes of guests who make a point to compliment the owner or manager at the end of the meal right uh, one of the things that will help you do this is for example using technology leveraging technology to be able to take note of those uh, clients that often, they come often, they like a place, right? Uh, if we put simple information like uh, about their name or if we put simple information about what they usually like to eat or how they like a specific meal, um, they're going to like that because they're going to feel like this is home. This is, I'm coming, I'm going to a uh, uh, the place of my friend or a family instead of going to any other restaurant, right? I'm going to feel welcome, warm and welcome. Number three, engage with existing positive reviews. So take a few minutes each week to respond with thanks um, to some of the positive reviews. We want to make sure that when you leave positive review, you leave information about the business there, like the phone number, name of the business, uh, special offers that may happen. Uh, the reason why, because all that affects the um, uh, your business to come up on the search results when people are looking for similar services or products. So, again, this information will not only help you with existing reviewers to appreciate the connection and make more of that, uh, but that will also help with uh, other people make more of an effort to become repeat customers. Uh, it's also a great potential for reviewers to be more inclined to leave feedback when they see the impact that is making it in your business as an owner um, and feel like they can connect with you uh, at a personal level. All right, so number four, last but not least, update your personal profiles, right? So make sure that your business profiles on sites like Yelp, TripAdvisor, Google, etc., make sure all those are up to date and that they have the correct business information and they have attractive photos, right? Because 
if a business page looks inactive or out of date, then people are going to think that um, you are not motivated to uh, pay attention to them or they won't feel motivated to leave your review or, or talk about your business because they're simply going to think that nobody really uses those pages. They're going to think that nobody sees those rights and they want attention. Even if they post picture about your food, they want they want attention. They want to make sure, hey, um, I'm the one that uh, post, posted a picture there. So monitor your online presence every couple of months. Uh, I will say more than that. Um, uh, of your marketing, right? Make sure you have somebody to check it every day if possible. Uh, get notifications on your phone if possible or have somebody in your staff to get notifications to continue to review that uh, because it will, it will help you a lot. So no matter what stage you are in the growth or development of your restaurant, uh, there's always potential to build strong relationships with your customers and incentivize them to leave positive reviews. Remember that above all else, the key on how to increase positive online reviews is always, of course, make sure that we are offering a great food, right, and amazing service. Customers who love our business will want to see it succeed and will be happy to do whatever they can to help. So I hope this information was able to what, helpful in some way. And again, just want to remind you about the special offer. So if you're looking to learn the same exact system I implement and use for my clients to help them to generate clients on demand or customers on demand um, that continue to come back to the restaurant, you can simply visit my website, www.digitaltrack.co, and in the homepage, you're going to see the button there to go and check out that free training that I put together about that. All right. Have a great one. Bye.